The majority of my investments in the stock market are made up of four to five different ETFs. However, I do have a small percentage in my portfolio that's dedicated to investing in individual stock positions. Now, if you've been paying attention to the stock market, you'll know that we have been experiencing a bull run for the past 12 to 18 months with many companies experiencing all-time highs. With interest rates expected to continue to drop over the next 12 to 18 months, I'm not seeing anything on the horizon that would indicate that we're heading for a slowdown in the market anytime soon. Well, my name is Clarence Patrick, and in today's video, I'm gonna be going over my top four individual stock positions that I'm investing in in 2024. These positions, along with my index funds, have allowed me to have a 35% increase to my portfolio over the past year. If you're new to the channel, make sure to like and subscribe and also hit that bell button so you're notified whenever I drop a new video. Now, before we get started, I wanna make sure that I state that investing in individual stocks is much more riskier than investing in ETFs. So if you're planning to invest in any of the positions that I mentioned in today's video, just make sure that you do your own due diligence. The first stock on the list that I'm investing in in 2024 is Eli Lilly. In my late 20s and into my 30s, I worked in the pharmaceutical industry and I got to see firsthand a lot of the good that happens within that industry. Now, yes, I know the pharmaceutical industry gets a lot of bad press and a lot of it is absolutely warranted. But I can tell you that there are some great things happening in the pharmaceutical industry and Eli Lilly is a gigantic player in this space. Eli Lilly is known for his depression drug, which is Prozac, but one of the things that many people may not know is that Eli Lilly is one of the top three producers of insulin in the world. And according to an article that I read, up to 55 million Americans are expected to have type one or type two diabetes by the year 2030. So Eli Lilly is absolutely gonna to continue to be a major player in this space. As of today, Eli Lilly has a 52 week high of almost $795 and they're up almost 30% year to date. They also pay out a yearly dividend of $5.20 per share. When you take into account the performance of their stock and the growing population of people that are dependent on their products, I believe that Eli Lilly is positioned to continue to grow long-term. The second stock that I'm investing in in 2024 is currently my favorite stock to invest in, which is NVIDIA. NVIDIA is known for their GPUs, which are utilized in games, cryptocurrency mining, vehicles, and in robotics. But they are also becoming a major player in the AI space. With the rise of AI sites such as ChatGPT and a lot of the things that are going on over at Meta and Tesla, NVIDIA is well positioned long term to be a major player in this space. As of today, NVIDIA has a 52 week high of $785 and they are up 63% year to date. Yeah, you heard that correctly, 63%, which is why they are currently my number one position in my portfolio. Now they only pay out a 16 cent dividend per year, so this is not a dividend play. My plan for NVIDIA is to hold them in my portfolio for at least 10 years because I am a firm believer in their roadmap, which is continuing to build out their GPU space. And I also think that they'll be a major player in the AI space. The third stock on the list that I'm investing in in 2024 is Visa. I was reading an article that stated that US credit card debt had surpassed $930 billion which was a $46 billion increase from the prior quarter. With Americans continuing to use their charge cards, I have no doubt that we'll have hit $1 trillion in credit card debt in the US by the end of Q1 of 2024. As Americans continue to charge, it has allowed credit card companies such as Visa to continue to see all-time highs in the stock market. As of today, Visa has a 52 week high of $284 per share 
and they are up nearly 10% year to date. They also pay out a yearly dividend of $2.08. As more and more people continue to utilize their credit cards, companies like Visa will be well positioned for the near future. The fourth stock that I'm investing in in 2024 is waste management. Now we don't often think about money when we think about garbage, but during this last bull cycle, waste management stock has continued to rise month after month. They own millions of acres of land and operate primarily in the United States and in Canada. And with the US being one of the most wasteful companies in the world, generating nearly 240 million metric tons of garbage every year, there will not be a shortage for garbage collection needs. As of today, they have a 52 week high of $208 a share, and they are up over 15% year to date. They also pay out a yearly dividend of $2.80 per share. Waste management is currently exploring how they can capture methane gas from their landfills and convert that into natural gas. If they're able to do that effectively, then they will be able to open up a new source of revenue that they'll be able to generate, making them a solid choice for my long-term portfolio. So those are the top four stocks that I'm investing in in 2024. If you're interested in investing in any of these stocks, make sure to do your own due diligence before you invest. Now check out the next video for more financial tips.